So friends, this is Yafid Munir and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to add a GIF in the activity. So let's start. First of all, I open my Visual Studio code and this is the simple code I write here. Okay. So let's go to Google Chrome and simply write here lot here the app native okay and open one of the link in your first line or this one I open this one simply install this dependency from here paste it here and wait for a while So our dependency installed successfully. Let's go to Google Chrome again. And my React Native version is greater than 0 0.16. So I implement these implementations. Okay. For iOS, install port. And for Android, go to Android app SRC. Okay. Android app. SRC after that main and java okay. main java and main application toward java this one after that simply copy this And paste it here. The next one is add package dot add. Okay. Where to add this line? In list directory. Let's copy this and find ways. This and this one. Okay, simply copy this from here and paste it here. You can see in this comment they show how I add this line. Okay, so what's next? The next is go to Android. App and print out cradle. Okay, I save this one. Then go to Android app and build dot cradle. Okay, so here I implement this one. Copy this from here. Let's Search complete. Okay, then complete. Paste it here. That's okay. Control save. What's next? Go to Android setting dot cradle. Okay, where is setting dot cradle? Here it is. And simply. Copy this and paste it here. Okay, control save, and that's it for Android and for iOS. Simply install port, just like simply go to CD iOS and install here. Port install. This is Windows. Port did it install in Windows. That's why I didn't enter this command. Okay. What's the next step? The next step is simply copy this import from here 
and paste it in your code. Control save and let's run this code first and after that we implement the logic view. For that simply write here npx react native run android. So our project is running in our emulator and you can see React Native shown in the screen. Okay. So let's write the code of Lottie View or for JS. Simply or write below this. Lottie view and close this. In this Lottie view, I import this Lottie view from this library. Okay, simply type here source is equal to here I implement the source and size of my GIF and autoplay yes and that's it. So this is the code to write a GIF. Now the second step is to download a GIF for Lottie because we didn't use a simple image for GIF. Simply go to go down here Lottie file. Open the first link. Let's start free. Okay. Now select animation according to your need. You can also search it here. Let's search here sync. And these are the GIFs that displays in my screen. Okay, what I use? Let's use this cycle. Click this and download this in JSON form. Loading JSON. Okay, so my JSON file is downloaded. Let's check it out. And here it is. Okay, the name is 1364 Syntata. Okay, drag this from here and paste it in your pod. I paste it here. Simply write here the source for that. Simply write here require and inside this require give the path of this one. So there is no path here. Simply write the name of this. I copied it from here. And paste it here. Dot JSON. Save this and select the size of my GIF, and that is gonna be thirty-five. Control save, and let's run my project again.
so there is an error occur but is this unable to resolve this icon so let's give here a folder name assets and inside this assets move this file okay now simply give here a path of assets and this control save and let's reload it so my app is running but this form didn't show because I wrap this into this view and didn't give any direction to this view. If I remove this view, just like over this, then my GIF must be shown. You can see my GIF is shown, but I use this view because you have to use GIF in anywhere in the project. For that, first of all, I resize my GIF into 25. Resize the same. Okay. What if I write here 40? Nothing change. It means the size doesn't matter. Okay, let's implement the size in this view. For that, simply give it a styling. I write here inline styling. Okay, the size is gonna be height is 200 and width is 400 controls here and the size decrease ok if I decide it into 200 and the height is 200 controls here and this is it in this way, you can use 